welcome back to my channel so today's video is going to be a haul of what i picked up at goodwill and also what i picked up at community aid so yeah we're pretty much going to be trying some stuff on so you guys can kind of see i'm really excited this is a little different for me because i'm so used to sitting down doing like makeup tutorials so it's a little different for me so bear with me um as i make these videos hopefully i can come up with better ways on filming quality and um content so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to subscribe to this channel we do pranks video challenges diys um house decor all of that good stuff so don't forget to subscribe to this channel so yeah i hope you guys enjoyed this video and let's get into it because it's gonna be pretty long okay girl All right, so I went ahead and put some jeans on. These are one of my favorite pair of jeans. I got these from Express. So yeah, I've had these for a fair good amount of time. Like, by the way, for people that are asking me and wondering, no, I did not get my BBL done. I get a lot of questions about that, um, about the surgery. I have the surgery on hold just because I feel like I kind of want to work out a little bit more, try to get like into a fitness routine before I get the surgery done. So just to clear the air for everybody that keeps asking me about that. Really quick, I wanted to let you guys know, if you guys don't know already, I do have three kids. <laughs> I do have three kids and um, this is kind of like how my body looks after having three kids. You know, I've always had a really nice physique area. So yeah, in case you guys are wondering, the size jeans that I wear, I wear a size 10 to 12. Because your girl's a little flat, like she a little fat girl. So be mindful that I do have kids, you know, I'm not the skinniest, shapiest person in the world. But I've grown to be very, very comfortable with my body and I love my body. Like I feel like for three kids I look amazing and yeah. Let's get on to this video so that we are not here for 17 years. So the first shirt that I picked up from the thrift store is this shirt right here. This is from New York and Company and the quality is so, so good. I really love that it's just very comfortable and it's a really really nice nice shirt the quality is good I've washed it a couple times and it didn't shrink it didn't change it just it's a perfect shirt and I love my basics like love my basics okay so yeah so this is pretty much the shirt and this is what it looks like right here alrighty guys so next shirt I picked up was this shirt right here and it's just like a plain brown like nice warm shirt for like the fall I just love it it's like kind of short but it's not too short and this is from New York and Company as well so you guys can see the tag right there yeah like honestly the thrift store is where it's at I've been shopping at the thrift store for a very long time. Like, I used to go to the thrift store when I used to make high-waisted rip shorts or high-waisted jeans. That's how I discovered the thrift store. Um, I picked this shirt up, and I'm going to try this shirt on right now. Alrighty, guys. So, this is what the next shirt looks like. Honestly, I'm obsessed with it. I love it. I just kind of wish it was a little longer because, you know, like, I want to cover, you know, this area right here because I'm not, like, the flattest right there. But, honestly, I really love the shirt. I think it's going to be perfect for underneath, like, these kinds of sweater type things. I love checkered. Honestly, checkered is, like, my favorite. So, I'm going to show you how it would look, like, if you could just wear it with, like, a checkered shirt or, like, a jacket or anything honestly so honestly this is kind of like how I would wear it so you know what I mean like you can do very different things with these kinds of shirts you can wear them with black pants you can wear them with skirts you can wear these basic shirts with everything and that is why I love basics so yeah this is pretty much like how I would style it with like some shoes depending on if I'm wearing sneakers heels whatever I choose to wear running shoes you know you guys know what I mean now I am gonna do a separate video on how like I put my outfits together and the way that I put them together so definitely keep an eye out for that alrighty guys so for the next shirt is this shirt right here and this shirt is from Express and as you guys can see right here so I got the shirt from community aid so yeah and this is what it looks like it's kind of like short like this one as well so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and try that shirt on alrighty guys so this is the next shirt that I picked up and this is what it looks like on like I said it's just a plain nice shirt that you can wear underneath like any type of jacket so I'm gonna show you guys exactly what I would wear with it and honestly these clothes were here they've been here for like about two weeks so I didn't purposely just put that there but I'm just like looking over like ooh, what can I put on 
All right, so as you can see, you can kind of just pair it with like a nice over top jacket, um, you know, any sweater that opens and stuff like that. So I wouldn't wear this together per se, but just so you guys can kind of get the idea on like basic shirts are always the best. You can wear them with so many different kinds of outfits, jackets, sweaters, and stuff like that. So yeah, so this is what this one looks like right here. Alrighty guys, so the next shirt I picked up and this says it's from Loft and this says Ann Taylor. And this one I got at Community Aid as well. And I don't know, the size says small turtleneck type of little um, shirt and it doesn't have any sleeves on it, which is good because when I wear this underneath sweaters, I don't get as hot. And that's kind of why I love shirts like this because normally if I have a shirt on like this, I wear something over top because I feel like my arms are fat. So, yeah, that's why I get these kinds of shirts. So, I'm going to go ahead and try this on so that you guys can see how it would look on. So, this is what the next shirt looks like. This is how it looks on. Um, like I said, a nice plain Jane um, black shirt. The only thing I don't like about these shirts is these are, like, if you, I don't know if you can see, which I doubt it, but this is the shirt that kind of have lines in it. So, like it kind of like flabs out right here and like right here so it kind of makes you look like fatter than what you really are if you know what i mean that's the only thing i don't and then my arms are so well but yeah like this is what the black shirt looks like let me see so um you could wear it with like a nice cute blazer like this um honestly i'm i would change the jeans obviously but um just to show you guys this is how i would normally wear these kinds of shirts i like to put them underneath um, like something like this because um if this shirt was with long sleeves i would be hot as balls and we're not doing all that so yeah you could wear it underneath something like this and you can make these shirts look casual you can make them look dressed up so yeah Alrighty, guys guys so for the next shirt i picked up this blouse and this shirt is from ny collections it is a snake skin print and it is just so pretty so i'm gonna go ahead and put this on all right you guys so this is what it looks like on the only thing about this shirt is that it unbuttons fairly easily like it's kind of annoying um so i will have to figure out what i can put on the buttons but i did see this one technique where she puts hot glue gun like because it's kind of rubbery she put it around the buttons and it kind of prevents it from coming out so this is pretty much what the shirt looks like and this is what it looks like on so that you guys can see yeah it's a really really pretty shirt i like it a lot i love the print and i think it's just very very unique so i'm really excited to style this and just make it look super 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 cute yes Alrighty. so on to the next shirt for the next blouse i picked up this basic and this just says basic edition i'm assuming this is from either walmart or amazon that's where i've seen like the basics at where it says basics edition and this is in the size of medium and it is just like this nice nude basic shirt like i said you guys know i love basics Alrighty, guys so this is what the shirt looks like on i really like it because the sleeves are kind of longer than normal and this is like a shirt that i would wear like all the time i just i love 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 my basics they're just like my favorite they're super comfortable i will wear this with sweatpants i will wear it with tights i will wear it with um an oversized jacket a coat like it's just my favorite so this is what it looks like right here so that you guys can see and honestly these kinds of shirts would be perfect for belts like you could wear you know what i mean like a nice cute little like belt so you can kind of style it with a belt. Now I'm just going to throw this belt on really quick so that you guys can kind of see what I mean. Alrighty, so you can go ahead and throw it on with a belt like this. Now the belt's not on correctly um, because it's not in the loops and it's not like super tight. But yeah, you could wear it like this or you could wear it with like a different color belt. Like however you choose to wear it, you can wear it. Alright, let me put this back. <laughs> all right so this is the next shirt that i picked up it is actually i want to say this is a guy's shirt but i'm not sure but i do know that this is armani exchange because i can tell by the tags i do have two armani shirts that i have and i can tell by the tag but unfortunately somebody ripped it off um i love the texture of the shirt and it is just pretty and just so textury and just different i love it i love it i love it my daughter was like oh that looks like an old man's shirt so i'm gonna go ahead and put this on and i'll be right back so this is the next shirt i'm sorry y'all i am hungry and i'm waiting for dinner 
and I don't like to eat like junk food so I'm eating avocado this is what the um, shirt looks like I like it because it's like kind of loose and it's not too tight and I feel like it would look amazing with a black pair of jeans alrighty so um, also what I love about the shirt is that it has like the cute little buttons and you can wear it like you know you can wear it like open like this or you can just wear it like normal or, or you can button it up you know if that's your thing and that's how you like to wear your shirt so for the next top I picked up this little sweater and this is from Ralph Lauren and it's from the petite section and um yeah I picked this up and I'm gonna go ahead and try this on it's like a basic red sweater cute I love the print on it the little checkered print the texture so yeah I'm gonna go ahead and put this on and I'll be right back alrighty guys so this is what the sweater looks like right here I am obsessed with this sweater I love this sweater i think i'm gonna wear the sweater for our holiday pictures that we're supposed to be having all right so let's see what we have next so we have a couple of pieces and then yeah we're almost done all right you guys so i picked up these two pieces this is what i picked up this top kind of feels a little tight um it's just a little bit more fitted like up in this area right here but nonetheless i really do like it a lot um this is what the top looks like right here it has like this softness to that like it's just so so good so yeah and then for the bottoms what the jeans look like right here these are low rise in the back which i can't stand but i mean it is what it is for now they're not bad and i like them because they have like a little pocket on the side and they got these cute little zippers right here. I love the color of them. I think they're perfect for fall. I would probably wear like a nice mustard, like oversized sweater with these. Yeah, I guess we'll go on to the, the next outfit. Alrighty guys, so this is the last outfit. You guys, let me tell you really quick about these jeans though. These jeans, when I found these jeans, I was like, ooh. Now these jeans are a size eight but they look like they run a little bit big and the way that they are at the bottom i don't know if you guys can see but they're kind of like wider they're not like your typical very very tight jeans so i really love that about them this is what they look like in the back but they're very fitted and they're not too low right here it's a little bit like kind of big but ain't nothing a belt or something can handle like if i'm wearing a shirt like this it's not really gonna matter but um yeah i'm obsessed i am so happy that i found these jeans and i looked through all of the jeans i wasn't necessarily gonna go there to shop for jeans because i wanted more tops but i figured i might as well just look and i found these and the green ones now the green ones they were cute like when i tried them on i tried them on with a really cute black shirt and maybe that's why i bought them because it looked good together um and then this sweater says that it's from ny collections as well the only thing i don't really like about it is like this part back here kind of like weird like it's not tight enough this is pretty much what it looks like it goes kind of high here but it's not like fully turtleneck but anyway yeah so um i just i'm obsessed with the color i think the color is very very cute very pretty um and yeah like honestly i don't know i don't know if i would pair it together but just so that you guys can kind of see they have everything at the thrift store and i'm looking at the floor and i'm just realizing that i have one more sweater so let me go ahead and throw the sweater on really quick and close out this video all right you guys so this is what the last sweater looks like i am obsessed with this color sweater i think it is so pretty and it actually doesn't look bad with the jeans and i love the texture of the sweater like it's very very soft and it says on the tag that it is from ny collection the only thing about the sweater again like the other ones is that um it just kind of makes you look like you have rolls right here like on the side for the price of the sweaters i really can't complain at all because typically something from this brand would normally cost like $32 to $49 so I'm really really happy because this shirt was actually 99 cents and yes I said 99 cents because it was on sale $1.99 and I got it for 99 cents alrighty guys so this is pretty much it I hope that you guys enjoyed this video it was so worth it because I want you guys to know that you don't have to spend a lot of money to look really nice to look fashionable to look trendy there are a lot of thrift stores if you google like consignment shops in your area you can do like a consignment boutique you can do like a thrift store you can do um a community aid you can do goodwill there are so many places that you can go and get you know pieces like this for a very affordable price why not save a couple extra bucks instead of just paying for sweaters like this especially for the winter so i hope you guys enjoyed this video don't forget to 
subscribe to my channel go ahead and subscribe right right now don't forget to hit the notification bell button so if you guys are interested in affordable hauls and saving some money don't forget to like this video and subscribe so yeah i will see you guys in my next video bye guys